how to calculate the capacitance, voltage, or charge of a circuit. So in this video, we're, we're actually going to solve three different problems, and in each one we're going to solve, well, for each one we're going to solve for something different. So here in the first one, uh, what is the charge accumulated in the capacitor after a very long time? So here we have a capacitor. We want to find out what the charge is. We don't know what well we don't know what the charge is and we want and we do know what the capacitance and the voltage is. So let's go ahead and solve for that. In order to solve for this, you need to know this equation that the charge is equal to the capacitance multiplied by the voltage. So here we have a capacitance of 5 farads. You know, multiply that by the voltage. And the voltage is 10 volts. So the charge on the capacitor after a very long time is going to be equal to 50 coulombs and that's how you solve for that. Now let's go on to the second one. In this problem what we're going to solve for is capacitance. Here we don't know what the capacitance of this capacitor is. We know the voltage and we know the charge. So in order to solve for the capacitance we're going to manipulate this equation that the charge is equal to the capacitance multiplied by the voltage. So here we're just going to manipulate this and we're going to get the capacitance is equal to the charge divided by the voltage. And we're just going to plug these values in. So charge is equal to 1000 millicoulombs divided by 5 volts. So 1000 millicoulombs is the same thing as 1, uh, one coulomb. So this is 1 fifth. Oh, whoops. One fifth uh, of a farad, or you could just say it's equal to 0 0.2 farads, and that's uh, that's the capacitor. The capacitance is equal to 0 0.2 farads. That's what this capacitor is equal to. Okay, now let's go on to the next one. So here we're going to be solving for voltage. Now here the voltage we don't know what the voltage of the supply is. We know what the capacitance is, and we know what the charge is. So Again, we're going to use this equation. Charge is equal to the capacitance times the voltage. We're going to manipulate it, and we're going to get the voltage is equal to the charge divided by the capacitance. And we're just going to plug those values in. So 100, oops, no, nope, sorry. Um, 120 coulombs divided by 100 farads. So that's going to be equal to the voltage of the supply is equal to 1.2 volts. It should be of the supply. So yeah, that's how you solve for these. So that's basically it. I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, please like it, and uh, good luck in your classes.